Hi guys, uh, while my computer is sounding like a helicopter in the takeoff because I'm exporting the last video to, uh, to, to to put up to YouTube, I'm going to show you, I'm going to create a Facebook and a Twitter page. But before I do that, I'm going to show you how to create Facebook cover photo, Twitter cover photo uh, and profile picture using Canva. Uh, first things first though, I am going to go to... Um, find an image that I can use. So I'm going to use my business toolbox, paulnicholson.com, then the social media manager. And I'm going to, I should uh, I might be logged in. Uh so sign up is free to use. Oh. I have only just started using Firefox again because um my Chrome's messing about. Anyway, if you go to Visual Composer, there's other ways to get free stock images, but if you go to Visual Composer, then uh, select an image, stock images, and then go craft beer. I'm looking for something horizontally. So these are all images I can use. Um, it didn't come up with many, did it? Maybe I just put beer in. I'm looking for like a more of a horizontal sort of image that I can use across different pages. That looks like a bit of a crappy lager, doesn't it? So I'm not going to use that. How about this? Yeah, let's use this, right? So I'm not actually going to use that where it's saying I'm going to save the image to my downloads. Oh. Um, uh, beer, right? So that's how an easy way for me to find free images that I'm allowed to use is to go to social.paulnicholson.com and then go to images. You can Google free stock images um if you want then i'm going to go to canva i don't want to lose that page that's where i create the youtube thumbnails actually log in sign up social media and if you go to more here you can do so you've got social media which is going to be a square which is going to be good for your profile pictures then further down facebook cover event cover um, Twitter header, Facebook cover, right? So amazingly, Facebook have got a different size image for events and cover. So let's just do a logo first, right? Let's do a, a profile picture, I mean, first. So it's going to set up a image that is a square that is blank I am going to upload look at that picture um, my image that I did earlier beer alright it's going to upload it my computer's slow because the last video is, is converting to a video and it's just, that's why you can probably hear a buzzing but I thought on a video that was quite easy to use I'd You'd live with a buzzing and forgive me. So it will upload faster on your computer than it does on mine. Holy smokes, come on, there it is. Click it and it will jump it into the picture. Only problem is it, it stretches relatively and it, you can't quite go wish it I'm gonna leave it like that I'm gonna add text add a head in put in oh, world of craft beer All right stretch that out a bit move it up a bit change it to white change uh, maybe the font 
make it bigger text spacing maybe make that a little bit more squished put it so you can see it maybe I mean that looks rubbish but I will change it maybe it should be worldofcraftbeer.com download it right so that's as fast to make a profile picture on um, on Canva for the quit I'm going to create a Twitter profile Facebook profile and add that as the profile image so I'm just going to save that yes yeah, just save it now I'm going to go back to here and create a Facebook cover I'm going to go to uploads get my beer image stretch it off which is going to make it look rubbish maybe come down a bit show the heads add text add a head in world of craftbeer.com maybe come on stick it in the corner change it to white maybe make it all capitals and a bit smaller so it looks rubbish for now but it will do so download so that is the Facebook cover obviously we're going to take longer to do one that's going to live around a bit longer but just while that other video was um, downloading uploading um, I just jumped in because this is not something I think you all need much help with Twitter header same thing right so you're getting the gist canva.com this is I probably didn't jump in and say straight away what it was really easy to do um, Facebook folk profile pictures to do memes to do anything you want as a share so again stretch out that image that was free to use move it around make sure it's covering the edges insert your text your header What did I do? Add a tag. I thought I'd, I thought I'd copied it. World of Craft Beer. Dot com. Move it about. The beauty of it is, it shows you exactly how it's going to come up in um, Twitter on that header, rather than trying to. Before you used to have to work out what it looked like. Make it a bit smaller to fit it in. I don't know why next options. And download. Right? Easy as that. Free to use. You know, obviously you're going to be a little bit more creative with your own stuff. But I've just created those three things really fast. So on the next video, we're going to talk about creating a Facebook and Twitter profile. And we're going to use those images to do it. Cool. See you again soon.